The Saber Sword is the best weapon to unlock inside of the first C. So today I'm going to teach you how to complete the Saber Quest and get your hands on this weapon. Alright, so the very first requirement of the Saber Sword is very, very simple. All you need to do is get to level 200. That's the very first requirement. You cannot do this quest unless you are level 200. Okay, so once you are level 200, we can finally start the puzzle. What you need to do is come over to the jungle island of the very first C and press a bunch of buttons. I will show you where all these buttons are now. The first button is over here on this tree. You can see it clearly there. The second button is hidden under this little grass patch. You can see it there. The next button is right next to the blocks fruit gacha. There we go. And the last two buttons are over on this island. There's the first one on the tree. And right over on the edge of the island is the last button. There we go. Okay, so once you have gotten all these buttons, come back over to the middle part of the jungle island. And you want to come down these staircases right here. And just go down this little hole. And uh, in here, there will be a torch. You just need to grab the torch on the wall. There we go. Okay, so once you have gotten the torch, you need to head over to the desert island. So just follow me. Alright, so once you have made your way to the desert island, what you need to do is actually come across to this broken down house with the red door right here and enter down these staircases. You want to grab the torch you got before and simply burn down the wooden door. Once the wooden door is burnt down, you want to grab the chalice or the cup right here and now we need to go and fill it. Once you got the cup, you need to head over to the frozen village, so just follow me again. Once you've made your way over to the frozen village, you need to enter over into this little cave over here. Once you're in the cave, you will see this icicle that is dripping. You need to fill the cup up by going underneath it. After you've done that, you want to come out of the cave up over here and go into this house right here where there will be a sick man. You need to simply just speak to him, click the help button, and there we go. After that, you need to get back on the boat. Once you're on the boat, we're going to head back over to the pirate village, so follow me. Alright, so once you're at the frozen village, what you need to do is head over to the left side of the frozen village and go and speak to this NPC right here called the rich man. Pretty much just speak to him. He'll tell you that he needs help killing a mob leader, which is located at the back of the pirate village. You need to get back on the boat. Once you're back on the boat, what you need to do is just follow me across to the little island hidden away. Once you get to this island, all you need to do now is just go and kill this boss right here. He is pretty easy to beat, so don't worry. All right, there we go. So we beat the boss. Now all we need to do is go back and speak to the rich man. There we go. So we just speak to this guy once again, and he will give us something called the relic, which we need to head back over to the jungle island now. Once you're back on the jungle island, what you need to do is just simply head back over to where the blocks fruit gacha guy is, grab the relic, and you'll see a little hole here in the wall where your relic will fit. Simply go up to it, and you will open up the door to where the saber boss spawns. Okay, so he's not here for me, which means I'm going to hop server until I find him. Okay, so here we are. I just found him on another server. I'm going to quickly kill him before someone else goes and kills me. So let's go. Okay, there we go. I died, but I did get the saber, which is good. That's what we wanted. So all I have to do now is just equip it. And there we go, guys. I got the saber saw. 